Well, as promised, here's another update. So, there are a bunch more trees done. I always underestimate how far the trees don't go after I've made so many trees. I spent all last weekend making aspens and making pines and getting other trees ready. And so, I was able to get a whole pile of stuff planted, kind of get the crossing finished off. I got the uh, fascia painted. And then I've got all the trees planted up till right there. So I've still got a bunch more trees to plant, which will probably be next weekend's project. But I was able to take down the plastic and vacuum and kind of get everything back up and uh, kind of going. I gotta you know, maybe give the track one more good clean before I start running trains again. But I figured at this point I can start kind of getting things back to normal so I've got a few trees here and there I got some shrubs in um, yeah so the siding up the dock is pretty much all in done all the trees are in kind of along the backdrop there's a few here that uh, I've got to still add a few more trees here and there just to kind of break up the scene a bit but um, pretty much got her all done it's kind of looking down the tracks there of course down the hill and then down, uh, down there. I've got to build a house that's going in the corner. So, yeah, kind of everything's looking pretty good. Backdrops faded in pretty good with the trees. Pretty happy with that so far. Um, yeah, and kind of getting the rough in for the dock now. So, getting that uh, put in, a little bit of plaster here, and then start building the. Uh, ore piles and then uh, start working on the actual dock uh, which should be fun should be lots of wood and all sorts of bits up there so um, give you a bit of a rendition anyways of uh, I wish I had some room for lake boats to come in I, I may have a lake boat park there but uh, yeah this this will be this will be enough for me so yeah like I said I've got to do uh, some crossings cross bucks to put in Got a building to put in there, and of course that's the dead end. It's not quite prototypical, but it'll be close enough for uh, for all the girls we go with, right boys? So, yeah, kind of looking down uh, that way. So yeah, so far so good, and um, yeah, I'm pretty happy with uh, with everything. So, like I said, uh, I was able to take off the uh, all the plastic, so you can actually see my layout again. So, got foreign visitor here that I plunked down a while back so but yeah kind of got everything kind of roughed in again and uh, yeah I guess uh, now I can start working on once I got the dock done then I'm going to start working on the uh, Oba Lake trestles which should be a bit of an adventure in uh, scratch building trestles and such so but yeah it should be pretty cool there's not too much left on the layout to scenic Short of that, I'm gonna start doing all the details for the pulp mill, which is here. And, um, you know, start, I'm not entirely happy with the backdrop photo there. So we'll see, I might tweak it up a bit, we'll see. And then of course the junction into uh, Hearst here. So again, I haven't quite figured out what I'm gonna use for a backdrop along Hearst. Uh, I've never been to Hearst before, so I kind of like to, it's a little bit hard to see with Google uh, Street View, um, kind of exactly what that kind of terrain was behind the yard, but I know it's pretty flat up there, so, but yeah, we'll get to it. But yeah, there you go, quick video, and um, I'll leave you with that.